Okay, so I wanted to talk to you guys. I, I did um, the podcast this morning, and it was a story. I had a story to tell, and the story was really about money and shit. And it's a really terrible story because, like I said, when you own a home and um, you have to deal with homeowner stuff, you end up having to deal with un un things that you didn't predict things that you didn't think were gonna happen and I was dealing with a smell in my house I could not find I end up going in the basement searching it out in my basement bathroom that I don't use a lot had sewage backing up into the bathroom sewage like raw sewage disgusting shit in my bathroom in the shower um and so I had to have a plumber come I had to have rotor rooter come they had to come they had to dig into my into the ground in my basement dig up the cap drain out you know whatever snake the, the drain and do all this stuff and pull out things that you just don't want to see and smell and awful and after they left I had to clean out literal shit out of my shower in the basement and it was really a humbling experience because she's like wow I just I just had to do that but that little tidbit it cost me $800 out of nowhere like on a freaking Wednesday $800 and so what I'm always saying to people, um, and I, every time I do a video, every time I do a podcast, and I'm saying savings, you got to save. Savings will save you. You have to be prepared for the unexpected. I'm not saying that just to be like, just for like hyperbole. I'm not saying that so I could be hyperbolic. It's just like, oh, something to say, or it's like really trendy to say, because it is really trendy to say. It's real. Like, everybody wants to own a home. It's like, these are the kind of things that happen when you own a home. If you have a car, these are the kind of things that happen. So you cannot kind of be out here just raw like no nothing no savings because this is the kind of stuff that really happens and this is the kind of stuff that makes it really hard to to get ahead financially if you're constantly being hit with things like this so my advice is always save savings will save you savings will save you savings will save you you need to save you need to be prepared for the unexpected and let me tell you something it's always going to happen every the work they're always going to happen and that's why you have to be prepared for it so i tell you this is my story today listen to the podcast episode 109 i got a story to tell it's up it's loaded um check it out and if you haven't just catch up on all the old podcasts that are there it's 108 other episodes with a bunch of stories i have one where i told the story of when my car radiator just decided to die and i had to spend an unexpected 1200 dollars on that and it's also and I, and I tell these stories because it's why you should have available credit it's why you should have um, you should always have make sure you have um, some savings and not so that you can go on a trip to Miami not so that you can stunt on the gram not so that you can have you know uh, the newest this or that you really need to have these things so that you can be prepared in an emergency and you're not ending up financially strapped over a situation that you really can't avoid there was no way for me to avoid shit in my shower but I was able to deal with it pay the money they cleaned it out and then I had to clean out more and it but it's done and it's over and it's handled but that wouldn't have been the case if it wasn't for the fact that I was prepared for the unexpected so now I was supposed to get an apple watch today I will not be getting an apple watch today but my, I have I don't have sewage in my bathroom so there's a win all right guys have a good day